Hey guys, what's up? It's Meepa2, and I want to say we're almost to Christmas time. That is crazy. We have about two, three days left over, and I am super excited. And before we get to my very special Christmas special, we do have some things I do want to show off, and that is a new Pokemon plush to the Poke Plush Living Decks. Which, if you do not know by yet, the Poke Plush Living Decks, we are trying to get every single Pokemon in plush form. Once we have every single one, it will now be complete. However, we do have a new Pokemon that we're adding to the collection, and I'm super excited to say it is a legendary, and it's a legendary I've been wanting for so long. And if you don't know, I actually have myself a Zekrom plushie, which Zekrom plushie is really cool. I talked about it a few weeks ago. I did a whole video. It's very awesome. But as well as that, we have ourselves a Reshiram plushie. I actually got this from one of my co-hosts from the Poke Blush podcast, which if you want to watch a Poke Blush podcast, go on to there and check it out. I would love for you guys to listen to that. However, that's not the main goal right now. That's not the main thing we're going to be talking about. We do have ourselves a Reshiram, and this is actually the Band Presto Reshiram, and it looks perfect. Let's compare that actually to the Zekrom and oh my god first off they look great together I'm super happy to have this in my collection I've been wanting Reshiram and I've been wanting Zekrom for so long I got Zekrom recently and now Reshiram's here to complete the collection now I just need to get a Kiram and I'll be super happy but talking about that we do want to show off a Reshiram right over here the blue eyes is amazing blue eyes white dragon literally the literal blue eyes white dragon it's awesome Right here, the little pieces right here are actually like hard felt stitched behind. So they have like the rings. There's a few pieces of felt for the hands right here. Strangely enough, it's actually attached. The little horns, I'm going to call them. Horns are flowing areas right here are actually attached to here by stitching, which I'm not too mad about, but it looks weird. I don't know if Reshiram has a nose or not in the games. I'd have to double check. But the mouth looks pretty decent. The mouth looks like a normal plush mouth that you would see sewn. Obviously, with it being sewn, some of the parts are going to be a little inconsistent. But I think it's a decent little thing. I just don't know if he either is missing a nose or just Reshiram does not have a nose. But the feet are right here. It's a little harder than the other plushy parts. However, it's just kind of being to stand a little bit better. It has little felts, like I said, all around it. And it's actually not printed or sewn, or it is printed, not sewn on for the pieces right here, which I actually think is very interesting. And I'm okay with it. I mean, it looks okay in my opinion. Just kind of weird to see, I guess. But very nice plushie all together. I'm super happy to have it in my collection right here. The right, when we go over here, we actually have a very, very interesting part right here. The little printed areas, again, with the hard felt sewn on there. The felt right here. Very, very good plushie. It's such a really cool plushie, especially if you compare it to the Zekrom. Which, obviously, if you compare Ben Presto to the Pokemon Center, they do both look great. But I do think Ben Presto kind of has the upper edge. Just because it made this plush look really nice. And Zekrom doesn't have a mouth, for one. His head's a little too filtered up. I like it whenever he's, like, more facing downwards. If he was facing downwards or straightwards, that would have been so much better. Like, imagine how nice that would have been. Like, he usually is. But the fact that they kind of have him facing up is kind of... Uh, I don't really like that. That he doesn't really have any sewn parts on there. Or that he does have sewn parts, just not printed on, like, Reshiram. But I think for these two being together, they do make a really good pairing. Obviously, if I wanted to go for a Pokemon Center one, I could have gone for that. However, I got this from Sabby for a really good deal, in my opinion. And I actually got an Oshawa that came with it, which... Actually, let's show off some of the stuff that I've actually not talked about for Christmas, shall we? First off, we have ourselves a 2011... Oshawa plushie. He's like a little chibi guy, but he's also really big for the size he is. I got this for free along with the Reshiram from Sabby. I really, really appreciate her so much. Little hard nose. The face looks great. I think it's just a really nice, cute Oshawa plush. I thought it was Van Presto, especially if you put it next to this one. It looks so much like a Van Presto plush. I'm surprised it's not, but it is a very, very beautiful plush in my opinion. Super happy to have it in my collection. The face, I love the face when it has like the little fangs popping out. It's super cute and gives a little bit more emotion to Oshawott when sometimes he's lacking emotion. 
but I do like the lacking emotion as well. It's just, yeah, I do like, I, I like it. I'm going to be honest, I do really like this little guy. Very, very adorable plush. Oh, he actually has stuffing in his tail, so that makes for a really nice Oshawa plush. Now we're actually getting to some non Unova things, and we have ourselves a little sleeping band presto celebi i actually got this from a store owner on whatnot if i can remember i'll put her link in the description i do want to get her for a video her and her husband for a video on my podcast which would be it'd be awesome if we could talk to both of them that'd be wonderful but they are fuzzy it's super cute i think that's like five dollars and then five dollars shipping so ten dollars for a band presto plush especially this size and of a celebi is amazing one little winking eye and the one open eye the mouth looks cute it's fuzzy all around it has felt right here also has the string right here so i think a really nice celebi plush honestly i could see this being the actual size of celebi i don't know if i'm gonna keep this out just because i do love celebi but it's not necessarily one of my favorite mythicals. I just kind of got it because I wanted a Celebi and I kind of could not resist this offer. It's such a cute little plushie. And I think it works out for what it is. A very, very cute. The fuzz is what gets me. I love whenever Ben Presto has like fuzzy plushies. They always look so cute and I'm super happy we have I'm super happy we have ourselves a nice little Celebi plush to add to the collection. And then I know you guys see him. I have not talked about him yet unless you actually watch the podcast. We have ourselves the big Pikachu Squish Mellow. And he is absolutely adorable. He is humongous. My cousin actually got him from Target, which I really appreciate here with the Squishmallow Christmas tag. That's going to be a cute tag to have in the future. I love Squishmallow tags, by the way. I like how they have the name. They have everything. There's some info on them. Very, very cute plushie all together. More Squish. Encore plush de plushies. It's a really cute. Infra Pikachu. Very, very cute plushie. It has the Santa hat, which is really soft, by the way. Squishmallows, if you guys don't know, are pretty soft, pretty cuddly. You could cuddle with them, go night night with them. Very, very adorable plushie. I'm super happy to have this in my collection because I've been wanting a big Squishmallow. I'll be honest, I've been kind of wanting a Squishmallow that's like really big. However, I was never going to spend the money to get one for myself. So the fact that my cousin actually did for me, I really appreciate it. Thank you, Chris, if you're watching this. I don't know if you actually are. I don't think you watch my videos, but very awesome. And we'll now forever have this piece of history with us. And I cannot wait for in the future when we have more Christmas specials, because it's actually the first year we've done Christmas specials at all, or just holiday specials in general. Super happy to have him in, and we'll definitely have him in the background again next year. Then finally, we have ourselves a sleeping Charmander to go with it. Oh my gosh. He is really cuddly and really warm, really soft. You can just squeeze him. He has like that mochi like feeling to him. Here's the face. He's kind of like a little bit of a cleft chin, which is kind of like, uh, I wanted to get my girlfriend the Bulbasaur or for her to get the Bulbasaur, but she just does not like the chin for it, which I understand. But this Charmander, I got it for very cheap. I got it for about 20 bucks. It's usually like 25 to 30 bucks, I believe, for the plush. However, the fact that I was actually able to get him 20 bucks is because they were having a little discount on him, Bulbasaur, and I think Pikachu. Maybe Pikachu? I don't know. And Squirtle, I believe. And the fact that I was able to get him, which I've actually really wanted this Charmander. I just did not see myself spending money, especially because I have the Build-A-Bear and I have another Charmander plush. I was just like, oh, I can't do it. I just can't. But now the fact that we have him over here makes me very happy to have him in the collection. But <laughs> so we do have ourselves a bunch of plushies right now. It's so awesome. A bunch of new friends to have in our collection. Super excited. We have a new Reshiram, a new Celebi, and I think that's it for the new, new Pokemons. Then we have the return of another Oshawa, another Pikachu, and of course, another Charmander. Very awesome collection to add. I know it's Unova month, but we did have some stuff that weren't technically Unova. We had three, to be exact. But honestly, I'm really happy. This is going to be just a Reshiram video, but I thought I might as well just show off everything that I've gotten recently. Especially because I wanted to talk about this guy, and I know... Even though it's you know of a month, I wouldn't have enough time to talk about them. But yeah. So while this is mainly gonna be a Reshiram video, I'm super excited that we do have Reshiram and Zekrom, like I said. We gotta figure out where to put all these plushies. So give me one moment and I'll figure that out. I have Reshiram and Zekrom right here. 
I ended up putting some of the new guys that we actually got in the boxes there, there for now. You will probably see them on Christmas, but just, just pretend you did not. I, I kind of did all the cleaning around. But yeah, for the most part, I think everything is just back where they're supposed to be, which looks pretty good. But I'll see you guys next time. It's going to be Christmas. Uh, let's get back to me. All right, guys, that's going to be it for me. I really appreciate y'all coming and watching. Merry Christmas to all. I do have a very special Christmas special coming out, which I'm super excited to show off. But from now on, I think that's it, actually. So, yeah, from my family to you, have a wonderful Christmas. And I will see you guys on Christmas Day with a special good luck to video. Peace out.